morning everyone good morning good morning whatever it's currently 9 17 a.m and in a bit we're about to leave i'm going to have a quick breakfast right now here's my food we have um wheat bread wheat bread but it's like pandesal in the philippines <laughs> but it's wheat and then egg and then we have you can't see it but it's an oat milk it's so good don't mind me if i dip it because that's what you should do there's like an important event is it an event um at school like we applied i applied for two schools this is one of the schools it's the college one which is what i prefer most because you know college it's college you'll only have to stick to one course or like one subject you know what you're going to focus on i like the other school that i applied which is you have to pick three subjects and then they would still see if like the timetable of the subjects you chose won't clash so it still depends but in my case they chose my subjects because the subjects i chose would clash and it's not what i want because the subjects they chose are like math and i hate math so much well i chose business because you know i think it's necessary as well for what I would like to take in free school, which is fashion design and then art, obviously. And um, I was supposed to take textiles as well, but I think it would clash. So they gave me computing instead, which is. Okay, so I'm going to show you my outfit. Um, I got this sweater from H&M. This white long sleeve. This is thrifted from the Philippines. This jeans. It's like from an instagram shop and i think i'm going to wear my converse front star hike today because you know you'll never go wrong with converse <laughs> as your kicks <laughs> to the cafeteria and it was like divided by courses like performing arts, um, media, business, science and stuff and then I didn't find arts and design so like I was like looking everywhere and I can feel like the people were staring at me were looking at me I feel like their eyes were on me you know that feeling that you get in movies it was literally like that I kind of felt nervous but also like I don't care they were like oh wearing black and I'm wearing this one it's kind of flashy color it's white and green and everyone's like wearing anything basically they dress up like how they want to and even wore makeup how they wanted to dye their hair having those piercings and that yeah there's like four stations so the first room had like an activity with mark i forgot what the mark spotting mark something like printing you know transferring ink to paper and making some different designs different textures and styles i don't know what it's called but yeah and we even wore an apron which was pretty exciting because you know that's an art vibes when you're an artist i also tried to film i wanted to ask but i just didn't get myself to ask if it's allowed to film so i filmed only a bit and then the second room it was a digital room where we used photoshop and i think it's kind of like my field you know media and yeah i think i did pretty well and you know um the teacher even saved my work which is 
No, compliment for me. I think today, I don't know, I don't think they're providing any invoice today, I don't know. Do you want to say hi? And the highlight part would be me getting along with these two girls from Olivia and Izzy. They're so friendly and so nice. <laughs> And I'm actually older than them. I think most of yeah, most of the students are. I think I'm older because I, no, I'm not going to explain it anymore. But anyways, yeah. After that, we went to the third room. We get to draw what's in front of us. I personally think that the, the subjects that were in front of me are like so good and so cool, and especially the body. Oh my gosh! Because as you know, I'm pretty interested with um drawing bodies and you know human and other something like that but yeah i really like showing the body and it was it was good i think it went well i think my drawing is not that bad um not everyone is actually that good that good for you to get um for you to get insecure is that the same for you to get unmotivated or so yeah i think there are people that are on my level so like i'm quite comfortable with what i'm doing and then, yeah we did four types of stuff like types of materials that we use like i don't know there was charcoal there was pencil there was a pen line drawing yeah that's it and then for the last room there it was like a sculpting room like you know more on building and creating things i was pretty excited on that room because you know we get to sculpt something and we did um sculpt what we drew on the third room which is pretty 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 amazing and exciting so i really wish that we get to keep it but then no we already went home and then they still need to put it in the kiln i don't know but that vibes really reminds me of nabi from nevertheless because she's like an art student i really want to be that kind of person you know the artsy aesthetic person and then i asked the teacher if we were allowed to film and then he said no <laughs> he was asking if it was for social media i think and i said yes and yeah he didn't let me but he said it's a good thing that i asked i really wish that i i took a snap of what i made but never mind and then when we went out they gave this id and i was like what's this and then i was quite confused of what was going on but i think it is what it is hopefully now i can really go into this school because i think it's amazing i really had fun it was so exciting yeah i think the people are so you know it's not really strict and strict and i don't know what the term but not really i just can't wait to have friends here and you know just get along with everyone bye, <laughs> bye. time check time check it's 2 30 p.m we are at Telford. um um, we are at Telford right now. The school thingy just ended, and guess what? Um, it says, Congratulations, you are now a student. Okay, so there was no interview involved, there's no one on one talk, it was all activities. Um, I even brought my laptop with me because I thought like we have to like show our portfolio and something. And good thing I didn't practice the words that I should say if they're like going to interview or ask this kind of question. So chill about it. I wasn't nervous at all. I was more of like excited, you know, to meet people. I think this idea means um, that I can enroll and go to that school. I'm not sure honestly, this would be the school that I'd prefer to go in than the sixth form school. I'm going to talk to you later.
um, pork belly ramen.